this video explains how you can connect to your cloud machine like for example if you're using e ec2 in aws or any uh, the virtual machine in azure or google cloud computing and you want to transfer some files using ftp so how you can do that using ssh protocol so generally what happens is in ftp protocol you need to set up ftp users and passwords for that user on that machine but that is just one way to connect to the ftp server you can also connect to ftp server through ssh as well now to connect uh, to your machine and uh, to upload the files through filezilla what you have to do is you have to go to file of, uh, go to this filezilla option and then click on settings and then click on sftp remember that filezilla have two protocols major protocols ftp and sftp so in ftp what happens is user id and password is sent in plain text in sftp the files are encrypted using the ssh and then sent so that's why it's called as sftp now you have to go to sftp and then add your key So here you can see I have already added one key. If you want to add, you can add by clicking on this one. And then this is the first step. Now next thing that you need to do is go to site manager in the file option. And then in here, you have to click on new site. Here select SFTP then give the host name that is your ec2 uh, instance or any virtual machine ip address port is by default this 22 because that is the port to fair ssh protocol will communicate here you can put logon type as normal and then give the user as ec2 user or whatever is the username but i don't think this username and password is required uh, since you have got the ssh you have set up the ssh keys and then you have to click on connect if everything is all right then you should be connecting to the machine and then you should be able to list down all the files on that system like you can see here i have connected to softhost.org which is on my ec2 instance and then this is my local site so if you're facing any issues uh, while connecting to through this ssh and file let me know through the comments thanks for watching this video